guys. So today I'll be installing the Seagate Barracuda 1.5 terabyte uh, drive into this into the Mac Pro. Um, this is actually it's kind of interesting. It's a 5900 RPM drive. I don't know why that is, but uh, it seemed pretty interesting. It was supposed to run to have it was supposed to have the same speed as a 7200 RPM, but use less power. So that was cool. Um, so here's the Mac Pro itself. And locate your hard drive. I'll be installing this in drive number three. So to do this, all you do is you grab underneath the lever here and simply pull it out. So here I have all my drives are already maxed out. I have three one terabyte drives installed and one 500. So I'm going to be replacing this 500 with a 1.5 terabyte. pretty cool. So there you have your, this is the old drive. Don't know what I'm going to do with this thing. So. I've had very bad luck with Western Digital hard drives, so that's why I go with Seagate most of the time. So they actually, it's surprising, they actually give you a SATA cable and some software, but that's for PC, so I won't be using that. So you can see there, my five terabytes. So make sure the connections on the back are facing the opposite direction in which you install the bracket. I really like how easy it is to install a hard drive in a Mac Pro. And then from here on it's pretty boring. So I'll make a video when I have it plugged in. So I selected my hard drive from the list. I initialized it. I just choose erase here with Mac OS General. So there's the new hard drive, 1.5 terabytes available. So thanks for watching.